The Mark Thompson Show. It would not be the holidays. It would not be the holidays without mom and dad. Come on. How about it, mom and dad? How are you? Hello. We're hanging in. How You're you? hanging in at 93. That is true. Pretty terrific that yeah, at 93, you guys are still click clacking in uh, every way. I don't know. We're, 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 stand, we're standing by. Right? <laughs> <laughs> well, you're, uh, you do daily walks. I know that. We do. Yes. Yeah, we walk <laughs> Don't. <laughs> we, didn't, we, didn't do, we didn't do it today. <laughs> it's, it's raining today. It's crummy out. But, but, yeah, um, yeah right. if we're, Daddy's in a good mood, he'll walk to the mailbox. If huh? he's not in a good mood, he walks to the corner. That's right. Okay. But anyway, we yeah we we walk a little bit just to keep in in some blood rough, circulating, rough shape. Yeah. Sure. Of course. Well, not that's, that not that seems deal. like a seems like a solid plan. Um, the, uh, uh, the weather has been, ba it's wet, right? It's not, uh, it's raining. It's not snowing yet. Yeah, no, right. it hasn't snowed in several years. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Is that right? It's Washington, D.C. Uh, yeah, where my, my mom and dad are. This year will be different and we're going to have snow, they predict. Oh, is that what they're saying? Oh, I didn't realize that. Yeah, they're yeah. talking about a snowy winter. We don't really care anymore. <laughs> <laughs> a snowy winter was the big thing. Yeah. Yeah. Is, uh, I people remember. I remember the snowy winter we had in January. When it was yeah, there. several years ago. Oh, that maybe. was a big deal. I remember that when you were in your 80s and it would snow, you would still uh, attempt to dig out the front walk. At some point, I think somebody from across the street stopped you and said, hey, hey, stop, stop. We'll, we'll help you here because you're trying to shovel all this heavy snow. Very, we, used to, we used to hire some boys to do it. And then one time um, I thought our neighbor did it because it was cleared off. I wanted to thank him. Of course, he hadn't done it. Um, <laughs> it was the people across the street. She told me she just had to keep her husband and son busy. And so they. <laughs> well, you know, sounds like a win win, you know. Yeah, yeah. You know, we didn't do anything, but it was okay. It's funny that the street that we grew up on, uh, myself and uh, brothers and sisters and uh, that we all spent so much time on there are several new generations of people you know that this oh, yeah. it's it's retained a real charm that street but you can see wow. the the changes it's kind of exciting you know yeah it's, i guess i guess it might be for some for someone like yourself who's been there for some time and has seen it over over ages that is true Although there are now a number of people in the in the street who are basically newcomers, and I mean they want to bring their children up on a cul-de-sac, right? It's right. very safe, and sure. um, it was very interesting that the people across the street uh, gave their house to return from Ireland and London and bring up the daughters in that house. So they moved out, they gave the house, yep. uh, they moved to Bethesda, and uh, their two granddaughters are growing up on the street just as their two daughters did. No, that's really, that's really commitment to a tradition, well, isn't nice. it? Well, no, it's very nice. They got yeah. Nice. They got yeah. nice kids, and it's very nice. Yeah, yeah, it's kind of fun to watch the little ones grow up. Yeah, we have a we have a number of small children in the street between two and five, and right. they're marvelous. They are so cute. Yeah, yeah they really are. It's funny when I came back and visited; it, it, they're so adorable. It looks like some kind of magazine shoot. They're all so cute. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. They're all blonde. And yeah. gorgeous looking. No, that's just, and just one family. Yes, yeah, that's one family, right? But what about the people who are from you know your generation or our generation? We you know when we moved in, there's still a, there's still a few of them on the street too, right? 
No. I guess so, no. but oh, there was. Oh, there are fewer and fewer. Uh, uh, <laughs> I thought, I thought, um, oh, I thought, well, she was, who was, who was, um, who was the guy, the, the, the woman with the, with the children, the boy just came, he, he actually was, um, but her I, kids don't, her kids no, of course not, the kids don't, but I'm saying that people who were, Kind of your vintage, they're still oh, there at the down the street. She used to live. Clock, that's right. There are some. She used to live next door, and she gave us her kitten. Mm -hmm. I do remember that. Yeah, because yeah. The woman she lived with couldn't stand the cat. I guess there is. I guess there is a beginning of fading away. I think the rights mark. That'd well, be no, I, I, I'm just saying that. Uh, actually, just the opposite. That you're. They're people who are enduring through the many decades there, actually, even as there is a new generation coming. I don't think there's fading away as much as there is uh, both, you know, both the people who have a rich history there and then people who are new, you know, and creating their own history. Anyway, it's a, it's a neighborhood, you know, people come and go. Yeah, we got one family with three children. Every one is a blonde. One is cuter than the other. I mean, it's oh, just, I, it's just incredible. A woman yeah. down this, just two doors from us, next to, uh, just two doors down, the most adorable kid. Simply because they're blonde, 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 beautiful blonde. Now the mother is sort of nah, blonde, and the father has dark <laughs> hair, and um, and she said she can't believe it. Hey, so mom. Your, uh, your, I'm trying to avoid too many names because I have to drop all the names out so I don't get, yeah. Yeah. uh, the m memory I have, mom, is that you were the oldest person at your health club to the no, point I'm the that oldest person on the street. I'm the oldest person in the health club, which I quit. And well, you you quit the health club because they were closing. I mean, they closed to like renovate and then move. Well, I they think. closed for went out of business, but uh, and it became a movie theater. But no, then I joined the one in Bethesda. Mm -hmm. But because of COVID, they closed. And then <clears throat> Taria, I just found it expensive, frankly. Right. And, and uh, I thought I can take a walk to the corner and do the. <laughs> Well, uh, and I it, do my exercises. I mean, I lift my weights and, and Sandy, do very, my push-ups. Sandy is very good about all of this stuff. <laughs> she does. She does a really nice job. Mom does. Of of of. And it's important. You know, you got to move around. You got to do all that stuff. Clearly, whatever you're doing is working. So, uh, that's right. It works. Well, I'm glad we had a little holiday visit or whatever, and year-end visit. You know. Um, Yes. I want to get back for uh, in January. Actually, I want to try to get back in the new year, like right away. So yeah, after I, that'll after be I, very nice. That'd be great. That'd after be I get done with this uh, cruise thing that I'm going to be on, you know, I'm on this cruise that I. I think it's, it may surprise you, Mark. It may be good. You're going to really learn something. You might, you I'm going to learn that I don't like to be on vacation that long. <laughs> you might enjoy it. I wish I could trade places with you. I know. I actually wish that you would could trade places also. No, I I, I must say, I, I know i got to change my attitude. Otherwise, I'm not going to have any fun. But Dad might be right. I'll be surprised, and, and I really may enjoy it. And look, it's not like I'm being sent off to war. I mean, it's my God. It's a, you know, it's a vacation. It's like... You know, at some point, you know, stop the belly aching. I have to do that. But anyway, I um, no, when it's not like that, it's a it's a genetic thing. Daddy does the same. Thing. <laughs> <laughs> when I get back off the cruise and you know back into the flow in January, I want to come visit January or early February. So. All right, uh, lots of love to you both, and uh, I hope to see way more of you in the new oh. year. It's good to hear your voice. All yeah. right. Thank All you. good things. Mom and dad, Thank everybody. You. Bye, Mom and Dad. Bye, bye. Bye, bye. Bye, bye. Hi, it's Mark, and I thought that was great. Hit the notification bell. You'll know whenever there's a new video being dropped, and please subscribe to our channel to help us save the universe.